So now let's see how we can work around with dither and particles inside a photo -pee. So in order to work around with dither and particles, first of all, you need to go around onto the filter menu right here. And then you need to go around over here onto um, others right here. And here you can see that dither is an option. So once you go around onto dither, it turns into dot matrix like um, uh, uh, like effect right here with black dots all over, as you can see right here. Just like this. You can also go around for none method right here, which is more like a uh, complete cover up right here. You can go for Floyd Sinberg method, the bare 4x4 effect right here for more like a uh, square, square effect right here, just like this. You can also go around and utilize the RGB effect right here instead of the regular black and white or RGB 4x4 right here or 8x8 as well to make it more detailed of the dots as well just like this as well. So 2x2x2 two by two by two is the smallest one as you can see right here and this is the effect that you get right here. And if you were to go around and press OK then that is the effect that is applied. And that is how you can go ahead and work around with the dither and particle effect inside a photo -pee. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.